What is going on guys? I am going to be giving you a, another gameplay which has me and Epic Jester, we heavy. We're going to be uh, doing a pocket heavy medic on PL Badwater and um, we're trying to just um, carry the team here because uh, our team wasn't exactly the best. We had three snipers I think and um, at the start there was just absolute chaos going on. People are on fire and there's two spies just running up this hill. They don't care about cloak, they just face stab. But um, as you can see there, I obviously watched my own video use that Ubersaw as I did smack one in the jaw. And he did go down. I don't know what happened to Jester here, but um, I heard him screaming down the mic, uh, carry me, as um, he just had no health and was jumping down the cliff to try and find me. Um, oh, heavy flying and heavy dead. This video is a kind of crazy because literally every time I leave Jester to heal somebody else, he comes back with like two health. Um, I'm just going to push the car here. Oh, if you hear me taking a sip, that is my ice cold, refreshing purple J2O. Which, in my opinion, is the nicest J2O, and there is no debate about which J2O is the nicest. I lost Jester there, but he's back. Um, got the Uber, and decided just to charge around the corner and just wipe the team. As you can see, he's not taking this too seriously and messing about being a body. With an Uber, if you run up past the heavy as a medic and just be a body just to block bullets it can help we do make a mistake here we try to spawn camp and for some reason they were having like a tea party back here like an uber building tea party and they just destroyed us um, usually there'd be like one person that would let you through the gate and you could heavy medic the spawn and the car would be allowed to push but um, we didn't want to interrupt their tea party, so we decided to leave. Oh yeah, um, if you notice why the heavy's running so fast, it's because he's using the gloves of running urgently. And they allow him to run at like the same speed as a medic to get into the battle. I would recommend those gloves, because even though they do have crits above your head, you're never really going to be taking the crit damage as you've got a medic pocketing you. We did get um, a bit rolled by spies. Um, Epic Jester didn't have any back reflexes and no uh, team sense directions as well. As um, so, neither do I. I end up healing the enemy team at one point. But we do jump down. This crazy gameplay here is just a medic swinging at me. Don't know what he was doing. Sorry about that, the video is in parts. And back to the video. Here again is an example of Jester not having any back reflexes as a sniper is allowed to lay on a few shots with the Tribalman Shiv. Yes, I did remember the name of it. Apologies, last video. Right here, we're trying to uh, get the enemy team and for some reason Medigun wouldn't lock on to Epic Jester and... I had to retreat. I was desperately searching for an Uber and spies and soldiers were just all around me and I didn't know whether to Uber the scout but I saw a heavy and a sniper and I thought this is okay and just waited for Jester to come. The reason I'm not Ubering this heavy is because um, I can actually trust Jester with my Uber and I know what he will do with it because I'm actually sat with him at this point and we're giving shout outs so as you can see there, I told him he was a spy. Um, that spy is stupid. He he's always got his engineer disguise on, and it's really obvious to tell because he just bumps into people. Like herp de derp. So we're just going to move around this corner. As soon as I take the low health pop before you drop, I think. Yep. 
it's always important to pop before you drop. That is just that's just the golden Uber rule, really. We do end up getting air blasted, but um, it allows this soldier to pass. And some of the team did get wiped, but some of the team retreated. E.g., this heavy medic team, which do not see me. I take a few shots to the jaw to get 60% Uber. Thought I was gonna die. I lost Jester. Turns out he was just having a snack. So um, thanks a lot, Jester. Decided to uh, build a bit of Uber here. This place is always good for building Uber. Um, you got to make sure to move about though, so you don't get headshotted. And if you stay under here, you can't get hit. And again, the same Kamikaze medic going in with Zuba saw. He obviously got inspired by my video. If you haven't seen that video, check it out, it's great. And smack to the jaw again with my Uber saw. I think it's the most important weapon for medic, apart from the medigun. Because it just... It just... It doesn't compare to the bone saw, I don't know why you would use the bone saw. The bone saw has a faster swing rate, but... Ed, to be honest, you're never going to be swinging that fast. You usually get one hit and then the tree is... Usually what happens in the vita saw and all the others just don't compare. Here we do a trick called um, an uber fakey where you pretend to go one path then go the other. And also we stay around the corner so they think we've still got uber and then we charge around and they don't. So they're not ready for it. And this allows us just to push the cart while the kamikaze medic is still under there. He's looking for when to strike but we retreat. We do now have a level 3 set up. I'm not sure how long that stays up but um, that's a great spot for it. NG's pushing up on all sides. Make sure to spread the healers, medic. Even when you are just pocketing a heavy, I am giving some overheals to soldiers and other heavies. And at this point here, I think I do something stupid. I think, yeah, this is the point where I thought that was our own heavy, and I went to heal him. Ended up coming out on 69 health. So, um, not the best move to try and run up to an enemy heavy and try and give him heals. Um, the sorry, that's the un another part of the video. The needle gun that I'm using is the blunt saga. Um, the reason I'm using that is because Jester in the previous games was going down a lot, and I was losing quite a lot of health. So um, I decided to just try and gain some of my health back with that gun. The I usually use the overdose because it's great for spy checking, um, but uh, we weren't really facing that many problems from spies. And um, this is an example of me just spreading heals, and this is an example of our team, just three snipers just laying in over there. Um, not the best. Some guy was screaming on the mic. Um, Epic Jester getting rocket jumped. Um, we decide to be like a bit of a stealth team here. We ignore the heavy medics, two heavies and a medic. We go for this sniper and we drop down. So I'm quite proud of this because it's quite sneaky um, we end up popping before we drop but this allows us to get behind them and push the cart more because it would have wasted more time actually killing the heavy medic team and they probably would have spawned by now so this allows us to get a good push on the cart and again epic just having no back reflexes getting destroyed this bit was really funny we were just hid in a corner just crying for our lives I was like throw me a sandwich it's like no, and then we just went down. We did get rolled. But we still still have our team up there. Engineer didn't build a teleporter, but luckily we have the gloves of running urgently. It really helps the flow of the game and keeps the pace up and the pressure on. We're not worried about engineer setups, um we're not really that worried about Uber. I keep telling Jester Come this way, it's better, because I think this w this way is there's more surprise, and you can... Same there, using the same disguise, really obvious. And why would our engineer be back there anyway? This next bit's funny, there seems to be a um, kamikaze spy again. He wasn't using a dead ringer, but um, he just flopped just before the ammo pack and just before the health. And I just say, you know what, just fuck it, just go down there and let's just go, there's nobody there. So he jumps down and I get stuck, and then I get shot by a sniper on the way down and panic and jet into the corner again. But this time he does throw me a sandwich and we get a good push on the car. But again, the heavy medic team seems to get behind us. Um, 
I go for the health, and then I come back and Epic Jester's gone, and there's just two heavies above me. So I hide in this corner and I'll play some epic music. <laughs> 